Hey everyone, it's Steve here at the DJ Lab, and somebody on one of the forums was asking, can you control your NanoLeaf flights with an SC6000 or 6000M if you're not using a dead-end mixer? And I never really thought about that, to be honest, because the volume is what controls the intensity of the lights and to know what's going on. And sure enough, I hook my stuff up, I got a song going, there's my nail leaf lights over there. Doing absolutely nothing. If I come over here, and I hit the white, and I got the strobe going, well, I can control them like that, but I can't um, override a color, for instance. You know, I'm over on the override. All I can do is the, the white the blackout's already blacked out, so that doesn't help any. If I take the strobe off, I hit white. Oh, hold on. I got some override color here. Oh, that was, I think. Was that a mistake? I don't know, look how I got this going. I don't have anything selected. When I select something, if I deselect something and I do this, I'm getting that. Is that based on the bank? No. I don't know why it's doing that. Let me take a... I can't really see my other nano leaf lights for where I'm standing, to be honest. Oh, yeah. I think the other ones are doing the same thing with that yellow. But ultimately, they don't work. I even, and I know this is going to sound stupid, I even made the attempt to hook an Ethernet cable up to the V10, even though I know they don't talk, but just thought, you never know. And, um, no, it doesn't work. So I don't know if my good friends at Denon, if there's anything they can do where, I don't even know how you would do this, to be honest. I don't know how that would even work. Make some other feature that maybe it's still reading the song and maybe I can just manually adjust a little slider somewhere so if I turn the volume up there I can at least turn it up there to make it reactive to the music that's about my only solution because you know these are great players man I love them so much unfortunately the dead end mixer the 1850 just isn't that good you know what I mean like it's pretty good for the money, but I'd rather spend more money and have the best mixer because this setup here works really, really well. And I don't really use my nano leaf light stuff much because to be honest, nano leaf lights, you can hit the button on them and they'll go to the music and you can program set them up. But if you really want to use sound switch and you got lots of DMX lighting and stuff, this would be an option, and I'm going to roll into a club thinking, oh, I'm going to run all the, all the DMX light in, and there's a V10 sitting there, and I brought my own players. Come on, Denon. I know you guys can do it. Just add a firmware. Give me one extra thing in here somewhere that can just slide up and down so I can simulate the volume that I'm going to be doing on an external mixer. That's it. Talk to you all soon.